Welcome to our Python programming video. Today, we're tackling an intriguing question about side effects in Python. Our viewer is curious about the implications of using global variables and whether it truly prevents unintended side effects. Let's dive into the details and clarify this important concept. Welcome back to another technical video. Today, we'll be going through your questions, answers, and hopefully finding that solution that you're looking for. Guys, remember to stay just a little bit crazy, just like me, and hopefully get through to that resolution. Now, let's continue on. Let's start by understanding the concept of side effects in Python. A side effect occurs when a function modifies a variable outside its local scope. In the provided code, we have a function called double that uses a global variable y. Let's take a closer look at this code. Here, when we call double with y, it modifies the global variable y. This means that the function has a side effect on the global state. Now regarding the documentation statement, requiring global for assigned variables does not prevent side effects. It simply makes the intention clear. In conclusion, your understanding is correct. The use of global does not guard against side effects. It merely signals that the variable is shared across scopes. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. In Python, if you reference a variable inside a function, it's treated as global unless you assign a value to it. If you do assign a value, it becomes local by default. This design choice helps prevent unintended side effects. If global was required for all references, it would clutter your code. Remember, using assignment without the global keyword means the variable is local. This prevents accidental changes to global variables. The global keyword doesn't stop side effects. It helps you be aware of them ensuring you know when your function affects the global state. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. In Python, side effects can occur when different parts of the code interact unexpectedly. For example, if one function modifies a variable that another function relies on, it can lead to surprising results. In our example, func1 sets y to 51, but func2 uses the global y, resulting in an output of 5100 instead of the expected 700. This is a classic case of side effects. To avoid such surprises, it's important to use explicit global declarations. This keeps the intended local variables from affecting the global scope. And that's it guys. I hope this video helped get you that answer that you're looking for. Now, I'll see you next time. Please subscribe for more question and answer videos. And if you have any more, please just shoot them through in the comments. Have a good one.